When President Adam Obaru took power in 2016, his first task was to present the country with a plan that would guide his tenure in office. This plan, after a series of national consultations, became what we now have as a national development plan. A national blueprint that has, for the first time in the history of the country, garnered global support in the implementation of its goals and aspirations. This document seeks to fix a broken system that President Adam Obaru has inherited. Delivering good governance and accountability, social cohesion, national reconciliation, and a revitalized economy for the well-being of all Gambians. A key priority of the NDP is building infrastructure, in particular the transport sector, through maintenance and expansion of feeder road networks, which will increase access, especially in rural Gambia. In our series of coverages of ongoing development projects and programs of the Baru administration, Office of the President presents Fulfilling the Promise, the NDP in Perspective. This documentary series looks at hundreds of kilometers of road networks and other projects being constructed throughout the country. In the North Bank region, hundreds of kilometers of roads are currently being constructed. The geostrategic location of the North Bank has placed both Banjul and Dakar within close proximity to farmers looking for markets to sell their produce. Under the NDP projects, the North Bank region is currently benefiting from new road projects and the massive maintenance and rehabilitation of work of existing fast dilapidating road networks. The Barakerwan Highway has outlived its useful years. Old age is weighing heavily on it leading to severe wear and tear. It is dotted with both holes and light swaths, either cut off or washed away by erosion, posing great inconvenience to the motorists and commuters that use the roads on a daily basis. Because <laughs> Si l'on manque pour la tenir, il faut que l'on ait un terminal pour que l'on ait un problème. Il faut que l'on ait un garage pour que l'on ait un problème. Il faut que l'on ait un garage pour que l'on ait un problème. Si l'on ait un problème, c'est normal. Mais si l'on ait un problème, il faut que l'on ait un problème. Il faut que l'on ait un problème. Si l'on ait un problème, il faut que l'on ait un problème. Si l'on ait un problème, il faut que l'on ait un problème. Parce que l'on ait un problème, il faut que l'on ait un problème. Parce que l'on ait un problème, il faut que l'on ait un problème. This all-important highway in question is currently benefited from a big facelift thanks to a massive maintenance and rehabilitation on the NDP projects. Once the roads are completed, the drivers are quite looking forward to going back to a time that short lane to caravan will not be as long as it currently takes. You are ci fekke liggey neen ko ndax baara su rewu tak seigne dekk so gise jafé jafé bi am fi yop yoon bu ñaka bax la hakalan road is perhaps the most essential road for the people of lower nyomi it is the only lifeline for more than 15 communities being the only and quickest connection to baara and other parts of the region during the 2018 meet the people nationwide tour the president announced that it was part of the first major feeder roads that would be constructed. Hakalang is a Mandinka term connoting remoteness, meaning it is in fact the road that leads to the remotest of settlements in the region. It is a vital road that leads to one of the most renowned historical sites in the country, the world-famous UNESCO-recognized Kunta Kinte Island in Jufure. In addition to the central roles it plays in the area of tourism and revenue generation, Lower Naomi communities on the Hakalang Highway are quite popular for the success they have registered in the area of gardening and horticulture. The women we spoke to share their frustrations, all thanks to the non-motorable conditions. Another major feeder road under construction in the North Bank region is the 9 km Kerwan Jawara Road. The road is sponsored by the European Union, 
to facilitate easy and fast access to commercial centers as well as social facilities in the region. For the communities of Kerwan and Jawar, the road being built is a difference between life and death. They have spoken of how women in labor or medical referrals suffered unspeakable horror and suffering to the point of death. Young boys trek long distances to access secondary education. We spoke to one of the women at Kalulu in the country, Aja Hadipane, who described in no small measure the expectations that the road would bring. For the rest of North Bank, the story is the same, with the people describing the road networks as the single most important development initiative in their lives. Most villages in the region are far from the highway, making the roads the only connection to the schools, health centers, market areas, among other important facilities. For example, the people of Kachang, Alkali Kunda, and Salikeni, all of them very remote and far from commercial hubs on the main highway in the region. All the people we have spoken to, ranging from the Alkalo to the common gardener or farmer, all of them describe in cheerful terms how the good road networks enable them to access healthcare or even forge fraternal relations and strengthen social bonds. Uh, business atelekatna Imam masih masuk itu fintil. Sangat terlalu lalu dulu mereka sangat umariti. Walau jamaah jamaah kompilor lekas sangat umariti. Apakah ke mau kelim fulat? Masih mabuk awal yang rendah no. Sarat obuk ke biasa malu. Because bila dalam itu moment tu, abe mau wulu lulu mau keme orang mau tanil lulu kono. Mereka ni jinjin sate kono jang. Nih sama abu itu jang. Musuh kono ya ma. Watu dulu ambulans itu buat force nyang nyang. Puru kabu jadi ni berfara fenis atau mana sot la kolek aku lah. Tomorrow I call up Alifan, because in that case, Jambando is business young. But tomorrow, you know, Jambando is certain that what you came, you know, you are not motor kono. Motor, some other water, motor, killing the demand can hang on aido. The Central River Region is the largest administrative region in the country, with its headquarters in Jambore, formerly Georgetown. The inhabitants of the region mainly engage in agriculture production for both commercial and subsistence purpose. Over the years, the dilapidated condition of the transport network has hindered both social and economic activities of the region. The people most thankful for the road projects are the communities around Njao Salom and Chairman in Nyanija, where a 20 kilometer road has been completed Traveling from Jao to Chairman took us 15 minutes, a total far cry from what we used to obtain according to the natives of the district. The Alcalo of Chairman described in grim details the struggles they endured. Man my Jibi Cham Alcalo Chairman Nyanija. Paski Jamano Bum Yonbi Deforinko. Dan no so na chonabu re so jogge fi dem pofu do am otto. Saret. So demes be njau, 
de ngay luwe saret ngay luwe nga dogo fi su lolu do non liggey di fi yalla def bem ñu defer yoon bi legi yep bax na auto yi dina dem saret yi gis nga ñu ngay tak saret yi dina dem tank ay dina dem yep yi yokute bu bax la ñu am ci additionally we also visited the ongoing works on the 11 km nyanga bangtang bakadaji jela in order to understand how significant the newly constructed roads have been for the people of the region, we spoke to the Alcalo of Nyangabandang, who summed up the feeling of an optimism of the district ahead of the road project, which he linked to the growing commercial importance of the village. So, my Alcalo is here. The Quantanic project is here. We are 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 here. Yang bukan mahu fikir kon, gaya dengan sana terap. So tu sih bukan jangan kena ingat ayam motor lain ame. Orang bukan, dengan yang fikir yang bukan tulen dengan yang. Walau lagi dengan ada pesa falu, yang bini lemel. So karena lu nyanyi anak orang mahu bini komune am komni, ini dapat banyak fikir kau kodron. So lu mahu nyanyi kenal. Dah tu lagi tu kalau tu lagi kami ni ni bana terap nak. Walau dah nak ada fikir kau ayaf. Yang beri nyanyi kata walau lu dah tak komun ni aku buka garansi nun. Bini mana dia mula bumbu ni ni aku bunyul. Tapi bah terap senyum. Wah, yang mungkin ni aras. Bila punya pun kadang pakar aja ni mari. Tapi yang betrop. Wah, wah punya kadang fikir fikir betrop. So kalau santai ala buka, saya free project. Feel ni nyuri jaya sen. Kamu feel nyuri nyuri amlu mudi mas. So feel ni nyuri sen jaya feel sen jadi jaya feel. Di air malu saya pun kau soal feel ni nyuri. Wah, feel mungkin tam. Betul betul soal malu di ulin soal feel ni nyuri jenda. Feel mungkin mungkin tam feel mungkin sen capital. In all these areas, including Waso and Kuntaya areas, the significance of road networks cannot be overemphasized. Under the National Development Plan, the Sankle Kunda Bridge to Jenjambre, a key access point, is currently being constructed to ease mobility of both regular travelers and students of Amitage Senior Secondary School. For the people in the region, the road construction couldn't have come at a better time. <laughs> Mereka dia mula baki, tapi lama semen tapi dah falun rodo kita aku zaman ul lah barbi memikirkan air wara baki air wara mana baki masuk kunda mana bisi yang yang kerana mula yang baki ada ni kira lo follow 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 ni silo mungkin mereka wosila sanyi tang tapi sanyi tang kono tu komando narfah ni anda bimbi sanyi tawar sanyi tawar orang kau berbanding seven sanyi tawar orang kau berbanding sekarang ini silo mungkin kapus salur kerana ini sado kono bah bongkang iman mereka kang baki kang Kerana aku kan musa rongan, sebab aku siap orang beli barang. Jackson sih, kerana aku ambil sekolah, aku kubur aku koma, yang ambil sekolah koma. Lepas ada dia baru, lepas ras pergi terminal, malam pergi terminal, iru okang. Pergi nafas je, tabanan, farababar, farabanyul, farabandang. Ni aku beka yang silu tak kalah jangan nyamperi. Bedah nuke aku ras pergi baru, tabanan terminal je, iru fana aku. Nanti yang terlepas farab farol farab ini, dia betul aku kang. The 3.5 kilometer gravel road linking Faraba. The rice fields is a key area in terms of access for women gardeners and farmers in general. This is in addition to the Nyangtanli Glavut Road, which also improves access to rice fields by women. Another important road that is of immense importance to the people of the region is the Jackson Street to the Regional Education Road. It is an already gravel road that is waiting to be tied. The Medina Jahali Road is a dream come true for farmers who toil on daily basis in accessing their farms and rice fields. This road, like many others, has a huge economic benefit for the farmer. Mm. Bar kemana orang pun dikasam akan berani. Bar saya ni sulo ayat untuk konten terbaik. Bansang is one of the busiest mini towns in the country. The road from the hospital to the town has been completed. It connects the remote areas of the community to the hospital and main highway of the town. The Pasamas road to Lamingkot has also been completed. The road is used by both North Bank and the URL travellers. It also gives access to rice fields in the area. The Chair Dankunku Road is another 20.5 km project that has been completed on gravel. It will give access to people 
in the remotest areas, rice fields, and crossing to the other side in Kau. Kondana The Upper River Region harbors Preston Boroughs' flagship development initiatives as part of the National Development Plan. The administrative headquarters, Basse, is a hub for economic activities in provincial Gambia. In late 2018, President Adama Baru inaugurated a 42 km road and two bridges that will connect the north and the south of the region. During the length and breadth of the region, one could visibly see work in progress from the road construction to the bridge at the Basse Wuli crossings. About 20 kilometers from Basse sits a community called Sare Alpha, which has close to 2,000 inhabitants. One could visibly see the excitement on the faces of the community members as they watch the tractors at work, despite the deafening noise and the dust that accompanies the process. It didn't take a while before the elders Women and youth of the community mobilized at the village Mantaba to express their joy and excitement about the road project. The alcoholic and elderly man close to his 80s recalls how they have longed for this road construction since when he was a young boy. For him, this road is a huge chunk of the challenges they face as a community, and witnessing a dream come true is a blessing. Women and youth of the community share similar sentiments about the project. community <laughs> Yo, Alhamu delight ye kaya ngalla da. O kudo orana hanke ta kekile do ko ya karu. Tampi ebe ganyo kama alla da noonda bogo kama. Sabono ya karu tampi nteni kekile kama. No untenga na agiri anga da kalo pitani nga anga neki nyo pitani ngalla masikanda anga problemu kita na. Alle menya kama saha anga na agiri kata kile ke kile ke kama nya anga problemu kita na. Alhamu delight ye kaya ngalla da. O waga tiga na machaku nangol nyanga na. O waga mama na. Sutu okube no kama chaku ndangolenga nge ba eta kono nati mutara ngolenya no konde yo wale mununde mana machaku nagaro ututikebe yito na lenu nya konde mana no kuntonde ma alhamdulillahi wa soronti gana oyu mamana kile dabara no ko sira wa gara mo ko sira oli o nyaali kanuari ka golenge mu asiro toyi yo be gana gire kata base sasa no kunte nya gana nga anki nya base lopitani nga Anna saharen kita timo konga, alle mena jare timo konga, anna ran kompen no konde. Ka kileke bure ngani, oga na giri kata basai, no unte ngana nyi, yero ga kenyene basai, problemu nan kita, mana alle men kita. Ka kenchu sasa alla da alli kembo go kamma, o wanya galini, o da arama baro tiga, o da di tarala monchu tiga, alhamu dilai tiga nga alla da. O wa chaina nuko ga tiga na, lenki ke kile ga siro, alla da saku baro nga kile nya kamma. The sentiments shared by this community are a replica of all the other communities in the vicinity. Good road infrastructure means social and economic freedom. Sotomas Samba Fita roads that connects to Numial is also under construction. This very important road network will connect communities to the highway and access social services and facilities in the region.
Another major access point currently under construction is the Pasiwuli crossing. Work at the site is intensifying as a target 2021 20, years. The bridge once completed will connect the north and the south of URR, something that only existed in their dreams before. Crossing to the north of the URR, work is underway, and one very significant route for the people of Wuli is the Baja Kunda Boro Kandekasi Road. Once completed, will ease access to facilities, enhance social cohesion, and bring about economic boom for the settlements in the area. One could conclude that President Barrow's announcement of 2019 as a turning point is indeed a vision that embodies a massive transformation and development in all aspects of Gambian life.